Research and development at the University of Minnesota have led to a new tool in the fight against snoring. And it's as simple as downloading a game on your iPhone. Reporter Kent Erdahl explains. Knee, knee. When University of Minnesota research. No, no. Combined with development inside the medical device center. Knee, knee, knee. Something unique knee. was born. No, no. No, it's no, a game that no, looks no, and definitely knee, sounds knee, knee, a little knee, different. Knee. This is not something you would want to play on the bus. No, no, you can't. You have to be in a quiet environment. <laughs> Brian Crone is the CEO of Soundly, an app-based game with a serious goal. <laughs> reducing snoring. Snoring is obviously a very serious social issue. Brian says the root cause of snoring in most cases is a weak upper airway, something the Soundly game counteracts as you play. It's just like, you know, if you hurt your leg, you have to go to physical therapy. If you have a weak upper airway, you have to strengthen and tone that. The game works a bit like old games like Space Invaders, except you say no nah. to move left and knee nee. to move right. Aw sound brings the back of the throat, the muscles of the back of the throat, all the way to the back, and the E sound brings them all the way forward, and the N sound engages the soft palate. So gnaw and knee is like doing a perfect push-up for your upper airway. And the game is already showing promise for snorers. The Fairview Sleep Center gave it to one of two groups involved in a study last year. The group that uh, did exercises had significant improvement in their snoring. Like any therapy, results do vary, but there are no side effects, and it only takes about 15 minutes a day. So it'll take about six weeks to strengthen and tone your upper airways. The app will cost 10 to $15 a month starting in December, but it's free right now, meaning you have nothing to lose except the snoring. Kent Erdahl, CARE 11 News. Users who are interested can sign up to take part in a free beta test version of this game. Stick around, we're gonna check in on an individual that first connected with people in her neighborhood and then many, many more beyond that. After some morning showers, we saw plenty of sunshine, westerly breeze, and that warmed us up to 51 here in Fargo. That nearly 20 degrees above normal. Slightly cooler tomorrow, but still above normal. Your forecast details coming up right after this.